Hey, what's up, guys? Brian here, bringing you the workout for Saturday. Uh, got another one, another fun one for you. We're gonna kick it off with our strength component today. We're gonna be doing every three minutes for four sets with a minute of rest in between our movements. We've got a kettlebell or a dumbbell goblet forward lunge. All right, so if you're holding a dumbbell, uh, I'm gonna cup it or the top of the dumbbell just like this. Keep it close to my body for this goblet position. And I'm gonna take steps forward or lunges forward. I'm right, controlling that lunge, make sure my knee doesn't smash into the ground. So I'm really thinking about here, grabbing the floor with my big toe, controlling that descent, gently touching my foot to the ground, excuse me, my knee to the ground, and then driving back and standing back up. We got one minute of those. From there, you might want to shake out your arms, take a nice breath, and we got a minute of goblet squats. But we're going to be doing one and a half squats. So they're going to look like this. Okay, same goblet position. You don't need to drop the weight. Don't. Just hold on to it. We're going to go down in the squat, back up, down, and back up. Okay, I'm going to do that over again. I'm going to take a breath in, down, a little parallel, up, down, up. Okay, ready? We're going to go again. Down, up, down, up. Okay, I'm looking to create that tension on the way down. So hold it, come above parallel, back down, back up. That's pretty tired. Third movement in this triplet for our strength piece. Remember, we're doing a minute at a time, so I'm gonna get into a plank position. All right, so here I am, hands are underneath my shoulders, butts drop nice and low. I'm pressing through my elbows and my shoulders to maintain a nice, tight, hollow position, and we're gonna hold it there as long as I can. If I need to take a break, maybe rest on my knees, shake my arms out, and I'm gonna try to get right back into it. Keeping those hips nice and low, abs are nice and tight. Okay, keeping those shoulders on, lats are on. All right, we got a minute there, and then we get a minute of rest after every set. Now, onto the conditioning part of the workout. We're gonna begin with a two minute wall sit. We're gonna rest for a minute into four sets for max reps again of goblet step ups, single dumbbell or kettlebell, goblet swings, rest a minute, and then back into another two minutes of the wall sit. Something a little different for the walls today is we're gonna be using weights. On the wall, feet are gonna be in my squat position. All right, a couple cues that I like to use here for me uh, that when I'm coaching people is knees track with the toes, and I'm really pressing my big toe down, keeping my feet nice and flat. And this is where it's gonna change, or we're gonna change it up a little bit. I'm gonna take the weight, and I'm actually gonna rest it on my hips. I'm gonna try to hold it as long as we can. If we need to get out, press the dumbbell on the ground. Quick shake out, we wanna get back on the wall, keeping our shoulders or our back glued to the wall that we're sitting up against. After a minute of rest, we'll move into the middle part of the Metacom, which is gonna be four sets of one minute of goblet step-ups, and then one minute of a single goblet swing. All right, I'm gonna be using this ottoman here as what I'm gonna step up to. All right, up, and then back down. All right, I suggest using something much more sturdy if you're working out at home, such as a chair or a bench or anything it's gonna keep you a little elevated off the ground. All right, for the, for the swing, all right, if I'm using a dumbbell, I'm gonna put two hands right on the handle like this, all right? I wanna keep my shoulders pulled back. Okay, I'm pitching my armpits in. Okay, nice hinge, I'm gonna bend my knees to set my butt back. Okay, big focus on keeping that tension throughout the midline and also through my hamstrings, really using those legs and those hips to propel the motion to get the kettlebell or the dumbbell in this case 
left shoulder and right high. Okay, from there, after four sets, a minute, minute, minute of rest, move back to how we finish the workout, which is gonna be another two minutes of a wall sit with weight if you can handle it. That's it. Enjoy the workout.